The people in Seattle are going nuts over yeah. Michael Dixon. He is really developing into a weapon. But he is also a trick shot artist. He is a fun guy to watch. He decided to bring out the Australian Dixon. A drop kick kickoff. Rookie punter Michael Dixon. Michael Dixon is doing things play-by-play -play announcers and the rest of us have never seen. You tell me the last time you've ever seen a drop kick kickoff in the NFL. He got a pretty good reaction. For the 22-year-old Seahawks punter, so did this drop kick. I found out that if you hit a drop kick through the uh, goal post that it was three points. The other day at practice, I hit I hit one, I hit a couple from like 60. 60 yard field goals. Yeah. You think we could see that? I don't know, it's it's different in the pressure environment, people running at you. Oh. If I get the chance to practice it more with people running at me and all that, then um, maybe one day. Your new name is Tricky Dicky. Tricky Dicky. Born in Sydney, Australia, Dixon has been kicking a ball as long as he can remember. First playing soccer, then Australian rules football, starting at the age of 12. We were always just uh, just kicking around a ball, really, and just loved, loved sport. Did you ever imagine you'd be playing American football when you were growing up in Australia? Not really, but I mean, I always had, it was always in the back of my mind because I, I had a bigger kick than everyone else that I played football with. Despite that booming kick, Dixon's dreams of going pro in Aussie rules football came up short when he was not drafted in Australia. Decided to just say, oh, let's just see what punting's about. Let's see if I can, if there's any program in Australia or if there's a coach here. There was a program called Pro Kick Australia, designed to turn Australian athletes into college and NFL punters. Pro Kick sent this video of Dixon to the University of Texas. The horns were hooked. You had never kicked an American football. You started in March, and by September of that year, you were the starting punter for the Texas Longhorns. Yeah. <laughs> I had no idea what I was doing, really. I just kind of kind of winged it. For Dixon, winging it worked. In 2017, he averaged more than 47 yards per punt, earning him the Ray Guy Award given to the country's top punter in college football, becoming a unanimous first team All-American. In his final game at Texas, Dixon pinned 10 of his 11 punts inside the 15 yard line, named MVP of the Texas Bowl, becoming only the second punter ever to be named MVP of a bowl game. He skipped his senior season. Michael Dixon, punter, Texas. And the Seahawks moved up to draft Dixon, grabbing him in the fifth round. He brings to us uh, techniques that we haven't seen people even try. Are you still learning the game? Are you still learning the rules? I'm learning it all the time. I'm always asking oh, the long snapper or anyone. What's going on? What happened? Why is that? What penalty is that? Never heard of that before. And you aren't embarrassed to ask? No. <laughs> it's an automatic first down ball in the one yard line. Do you think you get a pass because you're Australian? Yeah, I definitely get a pass because I'm Australian. But um, I play Madden as well. As we get set for football at CenturyLink Field here in Seattle. Does that help? Yeah, definitely. Oh, we start down there. I'm still figuring out rules every day. There we go. Dixon realizes playing in the NFL brings heightened pressure to perform. Another spectacular kick from the rookie. It's a weapon. He balances those expectations by reflecting on his past, remembering the kid who loved to kick. I try and act like the NFL isn't as pressurized and isn't as crazy and high level as it is. I kind of just tell myself that it's just like any other game. I just kick it. Good to just kick it. Just don't complicate it. You, you're catching a ball and you're kicking it. 